The military is preparing to destroy close to 175 coconut trees at Hickam Air Force Base. That's in an attempt to get control of the coconut rhinoceros beetle problem. KITV 4's Catherine Cruz has new information on the battle against this pest and the latest find at Campbell Industrial Park. Hickam may be a little less greener without the palm trees, but the decision has been made that the damaged trees will have to go. The tree removal plan includes about 80 near the entrance of Pearl Harbor and another 80 or so on the golf course. The bulk of the work starts next week. It's pretty significant, uh, but the, we're, we're try, trying to take extreme measures to make sure that the beetle does not establish. The state says the most recent find of a beetle at Campbell Industrial Park means expanding the intense trapping efforts more westward. We are putting up traps um, island-wide where we can access at about four per square mile. When we find a new site like this one, we increase that to 64 per square mile. This crew was out checking traps on the Leeward Coast yesterday, but officials say the conditions out west will hopefully limit the spread of the pest. There's not a lot of good host material for the larvae, so it's, it'll be less likely that we'll find huge established populations out there than places that are wetter and have more palms. To date, the state has set aside about a half a million dollars to knock out the beetle. The military is putting out $2 million toward the eradication effort, and the U.S. Department of Agriculture has kicked in another $2.5 million. The new find of the beetle means expanding the buffer zone for more intense trapping by another nine square miles. So far, about 1,400 traps are in place from Kailua to Waianae, with thousands more expected to be installed in strategic areas. To date, 540 adult beetles have been trapped. Scientists are still working to find the best way to eradicate the pest since the method of trying to get rid of known breeding sites is very labor intensive. Now, the rhino beetle also attacks trees like plumeria, pandanus, and areca and day palms, although so far here on Oahu, coconut trees are the only ones who have suffered damage. Now, officials say the beetles could become a real threat to California's $35 million a year date industry, so the sooner scientists figure out how to eradicate the beetle, the better. Back to you.